this is a very quick review to show you my new um, digital cl alarm clock with projector and it has the buttons at the top as you can see on this side we've got a four we've got the middle one to turn the alarm on and off and then the radio on if you quickly touch it and then uh, you've got uh, the first alarm the second alarm the radio mode and the projection mode these two buttons also work as the volume for the radio so if you short press the first button where it says time it gives you seconds if you long press the time will start flashing and then with the second button you can change the hours and with the third button you can change the minutes and then to go back to the time you simply press the first one again this the fourth button is one of my favorites um, because if you press it dims the light so I actually have had many digital alarm clocks in the past that they were so bright that they wouldn't allow me to go to sleep finally with this one I can simply at a touch of a button set it up to the minimum so it stays very dim and it doesn't keep me awake it does not work on the projection mode projection mode just works the same but I don't find the projection mode to be too bright so it doesn't keep you know I don't have a problem with that so I'm going to put the dimming uh, option to the maximum to carry on uh, showing you the rest of the buttons this one is the first alarm now you keep the alarm pressed and then you can set again the time the hours and the minutes just with the second and third as we've done the time and then you can actually choose if you want here for the beep beep option so you wake them with the beeping noise or if you press again with um, the radio basically so when it's blinking you can actually change the hour and the minutes but you can also change the alarm mode okay the same with the second button that would be for the second alarm uh, once it's blinking you can actually um, change the time but I have found that the second alarm shows you here on the side so you press it that would be the bleep and you press it again and that would be with the radio and when you leave it on let's say I'm going to leave it on there I have that the first alarm it's on radio and my second alarm it's on at bleeping mode so you need, you've got the two different which is really good because I don't like the ones that you have two buttons on what side I never know which one's which this one shows you each alarm on each side then you've got the radio button that would be the third one here on the left and when you press it radio comes on now let's see if that is the volume let's see if I can find one that actually can, can hear properly if you long press the plus that's better So far it is an alarm clock, I don't think that the radio should be any louder for me, this is enough to wake me up. Now, you can actually, as mentioned, find uh, the radios by just keeping the, the plus or the minus, that's the hour or the minutes button, long pressed, as such, and then when you release it actually starts finding um, the next one available you can actually program them too so if you press the first one when you've pressed the radio you press program it will bear with me so I go on the radio you've got different programs you've got um, up to 10 different programs to program these all you would do is go onto the plus and minus until it finds one that you that's the one you want and then you press program again and that will be saved on that one and then it goes to the next one so you can actually program 
um, see, you can actually program the, up to the 10 um, with 10 different radio stations and you program them by pressing program then you find them and then program again now the projection mode is also really good because this one has a hundred and eighty degree so depending on where you've placed your um, radio clock that comes really helpful it's also helpful because I'm going to try and project it here on the table I'm going to turn it on this gets turned off and off by the end button so as you can see now you can see the time there hopefully and then if I press it again it turns the time the other way around upside down which it helps me a lot to place and then it turns off so you've got it one way upside down and then it really helps on placement sometimes I've bought projection clocks and the trouble is that you can't actually uh, place it properly. Um, I think last one my girls had, I had to actually place their alarm clock on top of the wardrobe which was not very convenient to turn the alarm off in order for the projection to be on the ceiling properly and with this one I could have simply just directed the projection a lot better uh, to wherever I wanted it so for me that's a real plus. Projection's not too bright as mentioned earlier Last thing I need to tell you about this um, digital alarm pr projection clock is that you're going to require two um, AAA batteries which are not included. What these do is that if light, um, if the electric uh, temporarily uh, turns off, it's going to save. So it says 605, let's say the electric's gone. I've actually unplugged it off and then the electric comes back it's going to remember the time but the alarm's not going to work and the projection's not going to work either it actually goes completely off all it is it's just to help the clock remind the time for a short period of time also you have the USB entry port which I find a very 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 useful it's a 5 volt 1 amp um, output and all you would do is plug your normal USB charging cable which is not included and charge your device so if you have your new um, like me my new digital projection alarm clock uh, all I, I can charge my phone to at the same time and I'm not really bothered it's working at 5 watts uh, because I'm not going to be awake to remove it so I actually prefer it with a low output rather than a high one. So what can I say, it's very easy to use, very easy functions, it has two alarms, FM radio, uh, volume is quite acceptable for what it is, this is not a speaker, this is not a radio, it's just a digital alarm clock and the fact that I can direct um, the projection is a real plus. Also I forgot to mention when you're actually projecting there's this um, lens on the front of the projection that if you turn the lens around you can adjust the sharpness of the projection too which is also a great plus and out of all my projection alarm clocks uh, this one's the only one that it has these so what can I say I'm really happy with it and I would really recommend. So thank you very much for watching. Thanks for your time.